In today's video, I'm going to be doing another VOD review, but this time in comparison to my previous VOD reviews where I just kind of get your submission from my Discord. If you haven't joined already, link will be in the description. I would take your guys' VODs and just take a look at them and give you my thoughts of what you can do better. This time, I decided to contact a lucky viewer of the channel. He submitted a code into my Discord text channel for VOD submissions and I asked if he would like to do an in-person call just so I feel like I can answer any of your questions right then and there rather than you asking me in the comments or any of that. So if you guys found this helpful at all or enjoy this style of VOD reviewing, please let me know down in the comments. Try not to be rude to him if you see anything kind of funny or weird. We're all trying to learn here so Please keep this nice and safe in the comments. Liking the video also helps. Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell as well. And without further ado, let's get straight into it. So if you just want to say who you are and... Uh... Um, I'm I'm Zero. I'm a gold 2 Genji player at the moment. I won for Genji. Uh, I, I gotta say what I need to improve on personally. I have decent like mechanics, but my game sense might be a bit off. And okay. if I remember in this certain VOD, I did not get the best blades, but... Just making sure you're on uh, PC, I assume? Yeah, yeah, I'm PC. Okay. Um, so, so my first question is, oh, what... What are your main goals on Genji? I mean, like, of course, like, build blade, first of all. But, I mean, like, I'm always trying to look for picks on, on the healers or DPS if they're out of position. But otherwise, I try to just mostly farm uh, Bay Blade, especially if there's Nana on my team. I try to farm Nana Blade as fast as possible to get just a, an easy team win for the fight. Okay. Yep, yep. <laughs> nice skin on uh, too. Average... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have, like, I think every uh, Genji skin just don't really use major skins. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Let's see what you do. Okay. Your Winston kind of got cried. Nice kill. Yeah. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's my for both the healers here. Yeah. I that probably could. Good. I didn't uh, notice that my Winston died. But <laughs> luckily I had the Ana. Yeah. Yeah, you're actually building Blade hella fast here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, pretty good target prioritization. So. Thank you, thank you. Because yeah, yeah. I think, like, personally, my biggest flaw is to like know when I should go win and when I should stay back and like go back with my team. Because I have like a lot of like just like in game where I go in without thinking and just kind of die. Yeah. Um. Uh, this is just kind of what I personally like to do. But I know I know you got to kill on the the cast really early, and I think it's I guess okay that you're kind of with your monkey. But I think Genji, you, you can take advantage of a lot of things that most characters can't do, like mm -hmm. like uh, Sim or anyone would have to burn some cooldowns to get to you. But all all you have to do is just just climb up yeah, here, climb up and then you have like, like a way better angle from here. And and your monkey is over here, so if he jumps, you you can still follow up over here. Or uh, yeah. even if the sim if the sim goes aggressive, and T yeah in TP's over here, uh, you can just wrap around and guess what? This life weaver's all alone. And if he's gonna call for peel, this Merce is gonna fall. i go over here, and then uh, the diva either gonna yes. just keep shooting the monkey and get burned because she has no heals, or uh, she's gonna go all the way over to you, which uh, drags a lot of their resources. I get you, I get you. Yeah, so, as Genji, um, you, you t try to take, like, off angles, um, yeah, and that's man. that's how uh, you can take a lot of opportunities. But honestly, you did, you did pretty good, um, but I think that's just one thing you can consider. 
Alright, so, let's see. So, looking at their other team. Uh, they almost have a Nanoblade coming up. They don't, honestly, don't really have too much against your Nanoblade. Other than maybe Life Weavers. Oh, uh, shit. Maybe TP. Not hard to react with TP. Yeah, I mean, it's also like a full lobby, which I, I wouldn't expect SMXer to do that, honestly. To be honest, I don't really think there is a reason to play this aggressive because you already have Blade, right? So there's no need to like burn this dash through here. You know what I mean? Yeah, I get you. Because, because you burned that dash, I mean, you just kind of got fried up here um, by the, the turret and then the Mercy just kind of finished you. Yeah. Man, you didn't. You didn't really have a dash to escape. So, yeah, I so, think it's definitely uh, one yeah. of like the uh, biggest flaws, just like knowing when to engage and when to disengage. But yeah, you didn't. You didn't need to burn your dash. And like I say in like a, a lot of my videos, like just play your life. You know. Yeah. And you don't need to. You don't need to go for any risky plays like this. Uh, maybe your Ana could uh, build nano off you just from all the damage you took. You know. Well, you said you had bad blades in this game, so let, let's yeah, see. Yeah, I, I do usually have pretty good blades. I think like one of the best like gameplay aspects I do is my blades. I'm really fast, and I'm I would say I'm pretty good with prior target for uh, prioritization on them. Yeah. But this game, I just had absolutely terrible blades. Uh, remember yeah. distinctly from this match. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, that that was a. Yeah. Was a um. One. Honestly. My thing with Sim, uh, also, her beam is pretty big, so I think, and you didn't really need the, I mean, her tracking isn't that good, to be honest with you, but you can see, like, how she's still even hitting you without, like, her crosshairs, like, kind of not even on you a little, a little you know? Yeah, I get you. Yeah. But if, if you jump a bunch like that, you're just gonna go in, like, an arc. So, the higher up you go, uh, people won't be aiming like this. But it, it'll be a way easier for them to track you, because you can only go down, you know? Yeah. And you can't deflect sim shit. So, honestly, I think it'd be a lot better if you just, like, stayed on the floor, calmed down, and just aimed at head level, you know? And then you probably could have gotten this kill, honestly, because the healers aren't black yet, but you're kind of just jumping and panicking. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I would just say, like, just try to calm down. Uh, I remember it. it was quite a while. This match was quite a while ago. Oh, oh. <laughs> he just died to pub. I don't really know how I feel about Life Weaver. This tree is some, sometimes kind of annoying. They just be sometimes they just use it to block you. Yeah. Right, let's see. I've got like. Oh. 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 Uh, oh yeah, also, we yeah, forgot about that this one. This one, uh, the reason I didn't get like a dash to my monkey uh, knocked everybody away from me. Yeah, I was about to uh, say, was... Primal and, and Blade aren't the, the best uh, combo. I think, if I remember correctly, I was partied up with my tank this match. Okay. And we just like had miscommunication, just altered at the same time. Yeah, so like... Like right here again, if you're taking an angle from up here, you, you see how easy it is to just like shoot from Jump here. And then yeah, and then if your monkey dives you or dives in, that's like easy just dash through and get like a bunch of damage. Your monkey probably could finish or you could. And plus um, if I like need to retreat, I could always just go back in the room. Like, yeah, yeah. The it, hallway. Yeah, if like this uh, cast like comes back and like he starts trying to shoot you. Quite literally, all you have to do is just back up and like mm -hmm. you're, they're out of line of sight, you know what I mean? And plus you have this health pack over here yeah, too. Yeah. I think the Anna wasn't in team chat, so I have to add to like... Do you just spam uh... I don't spam per se, Z. but I kind of like just like nod at her. Oh. Like, do it once or twice. Oh. Yeah, I know. Ooh. Yeah, I was, uh, I shouldn't have probably gone for the dash there. I probably could have yeah. just gone for one swing. Yeah, I was about to say, because you can just one swing, uh, Baby Diva with Nano. I'm, like, not, like, super used to getting, like, Nanoed. So I'm, I'm, I would say I'm way better with a normal blade than a Nano. 
I get that, though. I don't get. Yeah. I don't get mad at myself. Um. Yeah, I I think that's just being a also just being a. Do you press tab a lot when you when you play? Just like oh yeah, no, I I, I check uh, like the enemy damage and healing all the time to make sure like keep track of like all charge and shit. Okay, yeah, I was about to say like um you do the the double jump in the air. You see anything that could like maybe stop you, like the honest sleeve dart or like a brig bash, whatever or boop. Honestly, there really isn't anyone on their team that could like really disrupt you. So I don't really. Um, I mean, it's just kind of like one of those cases where it's just like kind of a habit, and I, I, I can just like un unhabit it if I don't need to, you know? Yeah. Um, and I I was gonna say if with uh. Against Kiriko, I, I highly recommend you do not slash Dasher if you didn't keep track of... Because all, all, every single time, she's just gonna, like, Suzu TP... TP yeah. yeah, Suzu TP away. There really isn't... And then you're just gonna burn your dash and just be there like a... A sitting duck, you know? But... And we already talked about this. You can just slash and then... Uh, Have they still not added the feature to, like, check stats and stuff? Uh, oh... Uh, like for this game. Mm. Like, didn't they say they're gonna add like a feature in replay where you can check stats? Uh, I don't, I don't really know. Um, I wouldn't really hold Blizzard to uh, Anything, fulfilling yeah, promises. No. <laughs> <laughs> I think once again, like like you said, your your target prioritization is pretty good because I the the other like uh lower elo genjis I. Uh, reviewed they i don't know why but they just like let this reaper go unpunished you know but uh, but yeah you you go for that nice and like keep uh going for the reaper when he doesn't have wraith i think right here uh yeah you wasted your dash and yeah I, I don't I don't understand why they like the diva was shooting at you and then she just like Yeah, she just like turned around and just forgot about you just try not to I think get better at not like Realizing when to use your dash, but the higher up you go. You're gonna you're gonna get punished just for like uh, Doing that kind of shit, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, that's uh... Yeah, so Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. What? Oh, the, the Reaper. <laughs> oh, yeah, the Reaper just he, coming he, out of nowhere? Yeah, he just... He just... I think he panic oh. presses with... Oh, yeah. Oh. Well, I mean, you, I, know, uh, you know how Diva Bomb works, right? Yeah, line of sight. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure if you just, like, walk to the right just a tiny bit, you probably... <laughs> you quite literally... Because... Have you seen like those videos of just someone hiding behind like the skinniest pole and then they like yeah You move like right here. You're out of line of sight, you know, it, yeah. it's just some it's just some really really simple thing <laughs> A little bit of a brain fart. Yeah, but you know let, Let's just say you're playing at 3 a.m. And you're like fried or something okay. This Arisa is her biggest fan. That's the like, only decent ish blade I got. So, my team does. Like, this life, we were, probably would have just died and. Maybe like two slashes. Let's see his health. Oh. Okay. Well, maybe just two. Two or three. Uh, I mean, you did the best you could. Everyone's already dead. So. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, like, I usually go up there to, like, gather all charge. Like, I yeah, I, I do this. I do that a lot, too. I'm be yeah, honest yeah. with you. There's, there's a fun little cheeky spot. I think one thing to also consider is uh, who's like the easiest 
Like, looking at the enemy team and, like, seeing who's the easiest, like, person to, like, kill, you know? I mean, Sim... I know Sim's kind of hard because you can't deflect. It will all just come down to mechanics. If you you can kill her fast enough, if you don't let that beam ramp up and just hit your it's, shots. It's kind of the same with more. If you just hit hit your shot and hit your abilities, you'll be fine. Yeah, you can kill them in time, but it's uh okay, nice. Yeah, and then the more confident you get and the better you get, you can you can go for uh like right here. I I thought I thought you might have died because it, it may if you missed your your shit but but you got away with it you know because no, you're, I, you're I, confident I, uh, I knew her translocator was down oh she couldn't translocate yeah no i i uh we broke i heard the translocator break and i heard the voice line you know when she when it breaks oh yeah 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 so i decided to dash in because i knew she was able to get away yeah, that's kind of awareness yeah. i was just like hook hook then then i'd probably i would Turn around, deflect, and that should, those two seconds should buy you enough time to like, get here. Because you did have deflect online. There was a sim turd that killed me. Was it? Uh, oh, really? Oh, uh, I guess so. But I mean, yeah, like, that excess. Hit, hit me, yeah. Yeah, the excess might have, might damage. Might have been able to escape. Maybe. It's like two seconds to to try and make something. Well, I mean, you have you have blade coming up. You do say you do better with uh, a dry blade, so. Uh, I, I mean, let's again, see. With let's this see. one, with this one, I did like not get really that many good blades. So we'll see. We'll see. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's honestly that's. Oh. Oh yeah, I think this is where we lose the points. Yeah. Yeah, they yeah, used. Yeah, yeah. They used. Everything. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I think... Ah, uh, this is just once again like the... Um... Uh, when you peeled for your Widow. Nice. But, um... Like around here... I mean, once again, like right, you already have Blade. Um, and I think there's, you're just kind of taking like hella poke for no reason. You probably could have just set up here and you're doing with your tank, right? And then once they come out of here. I think it was, it was either my, it, no way. I think it might've might been the Moira. It was uh, either the tank or the Moira. Okay. Well, I mean like once again, any other games you have like think about setting up are the most easy blade you can get if that makes sense like there's no need to make blading hard for yourself because you just uh, if you're just up here you can just see everyone come out and then also say you're just sitting up here waiting yeah just pop blade dump this bap and then you also aren't gonna get emp'd over here right mm -hmm. and then you can even even though uh, the Sombra emp got hello your tanks down. You can make it even if you just, like, uh, kill this Vav, kill Sim, right? Then you can just try to make, uh, it'll be, like, Zarya, Moira, Sombra. So what you're saying, I could definitely, like, approve on my, like, positioning a bit? Yeah, I think your positioning can be improved upon, because it will, it will help set up kills for you and in building Blade. Yeah. Okay, so I think this is uh, your super blade. blade. So, so uh, what what are you thinking right here, um, in terms of like blading? So, like, how 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 is this gonna I be mean, like a clean blade? And you have five. I would so I I would definitely say that I I do tend to like panic a bit. Like first round, I'm okay. I'm a bit calmer. And then, like, late game, I do get a little more panicky, as you can see. Like, I mean, like, the, the BAP is, like, the only one that can, like, really shut me down besides, like, bubble, maybe? Yeah, I was about to, I was about uh, to say, you, you, with a dry blade, especially, you want to keep track of looking at the enemy team. And then I look and see who is, like, the guaranteed kill. So, so let's like, say Zarya has bubbles. You're not going to kill her. Moira has fade. Um, Bap has immortality, mm -hmm. burst. Sombra can just translocate. So that really leaves me on this team, Symmetra, because she she can't just, she doesn't have any like hard mobility. If, like, of course, the Zarya has bubbles, she might try to like bubble her teammates. Yeah. 
So if if I like go in, I'd probably like instead of like uh, I'd probably dash up a bit. But I, after like my blade and then my dash resets, I probably wouldn't like use dash to engage usually, because if that bubble comes, I'm just kind of screwed there, I'm just sitting there, sh chucking blades at like target is doing no damage. Yeah, and then once again with the positioning part, it, if you went up to where you're kind of like you just climb up here or you go through this you uh, can like a yeah because your whole team is here but so their only choices are they either look at your team or you're just poking for free ideally right this is a perfect angle to just like harass this bab force something out of him if let's say you don't want to go for the sim uh once again like take please take advantage of high ground like any maps like watch point or the or numbani whatever go here and like poke poke let's say bap uses mo kill that and then guess what bap is another free kill on your on your checklist you know uh um, we'll see what i do here yeah let's let's see let's see are we tracking sorry it's probably oh, gonna yeah. use nice okay. i don't know oh, i thought i would have used blade here i'm not gonna lie I have it too. Yeah, and, and as Genji, I, I, this is also very, very important to like, uh, keep in. Okay. Yeah, again. Yeah. Pretty... Oh, that was, that was hella unlucky. Yeah, uh, no, I'm, yeah, I'm assuming right, you, got, so... you got a little lost. <laughs> but I got a little fun. bit lost. Just, just a bit, just a bit. Yeah. <laughs> I, again, I, I probably wouldn't have burned dash here, just cause, you know, even though you kill the bab, the bab can jump. I'd say Moira, honestly, is more vulnerable here. Cause she burned her dash, or uh, her fade. She couldn't have gone that far, you know? And, and that's when you can burn your dash, cause then she, you, know, you know she has nothing. So let's say she's right here. Uh, I guess it's kind of hard to see her, but like I said, she couldn't have gone that far. So you just dash yeah. here. Slash slash. Then you could have chained up to the bab trying to run away from you. Blade's a pretty bad ultimate. But, oh no, it's a terrible But that but that's why <laughs> that's why I'm like it's it's so so important to be in here, you know. That's deep though. That was good. Oh that was good. That was good. Yeah, that that was perfect. That was perfect. Okay. These are the dash, yeah, those are the kinds of dashes where it's like, your whole team is with you, right? And you're, you have these, all, all of these guys in a pinch. So, yeah, like the, the monkeys here, you're here. They're, they're, they're looking at you. You're moving all over the place. Yeah, this, this is is lost, right? <laughs> right? And then your monkeys, like, taking all of the cooldowns from you. That's, that, that's kind of like what you're looking for. But now you almost have another blade ready for... Yeah. Like, uh, just like, uh, blade trainers and aim trainers. Yeah. Get my aim blown up a bit. But mostly can play that is... Gets me, like... Yeah. yeah. I think All I right. missed the... I think I missed the second, uh, slash on that. Everyone has their cooldowns up, and if you don't, if you don't wait for, like, your monkey to take a lot of those hits, then, then you're not gonna get anything out of it. You could, I don't know, instead of like burning your dash through here, see if you can kill them in two slashes, right? They're all backing up into you, right? But that is coordination, just like, okay, monkey jump in. And you kind of know like these guys are gonna get pushed back. And then it's free swing, probably drops ammo. The monkey's still with you, zaps, uh. Yeah, no, I found a bit of a slash there. Yeah. The Rissa is your biggest fan. Oh, she loves me. <laughs> uh, it's just uh, some of the positioning that could be worked on. And uh, timing. Timing when blading. Okay. You know, 100% to read that the service is gonna ult. Yeah. Okay, let's see if we can. Okay, so now maybe should be free, right? Holy shit. Wait, what? Oh, the? yeah. I don't what know what happened. Oh my oh. god. Oh, that is just. Bap amped. 
Unfortunately, with Genji, uh, your big win condition is uh, your blade. If you if it's hard for you to get blade or like get value out of blade, it's kind of hard to win the game. Because that's mainly like what you're building to, right? Because that's like one of his yeah. goals. Basically, just securing a team fight with those blades. And and I get it. I get it. There's uh there's plenty of times where like I play like complete horse shit. But there's sometimes where I, like my blades are like so nice sometimes i get no kills with the blade but also i think an important thing is if you go for a blade don't go like get too greedy to, like finish off the kill like sometimes it's just way better to just stay alive instead of chasing for that kill if that makes sense and just building another blade getting railed instead of just deflecting and coming back just building another blade you know what i mean is is that uh all for I mean, all your questions or you have anything else I, you want to say i would think so yeah i mean like i got like most of the things that i want i mean like okay i mean it's all uh nah nah i think that's everything yeah, you don't don't be afraid you can you can ask i'm i'm here all day <laughs> oh yeah no no, no. I, I don't I think that's everything though i don't really uh well, you, yeah, most of the questions that I wanted to ask is just like, you know, you know, what can I do better with like positioning, game yeah. sense, and stuff like that. Okay, and you feel like I, I can't kind of gave you the, the the right answers for all of that, or? Oh no, hundred percent. Okay. If you have any other questions, feel free to uh, DM or even send another VOD submission. I'll see what we can do. Uh, again, thank you, man. That was like really informative. I'll try to like uh, try to like implement the your uh, tips into my playstyle. See what I can change. See what I can improve. Yeah, yeah. Well, with that being said, I'll see you some other time.